everybody welcome to life entertainment's channel in today's video i'll be creating a bootable flash drive on a macbook pro and i'll make it bootable from os catalina the latest operating system all right so to get started the first thing you want to do is on the upper right corner of the screen there is this little search icon click on it and type in terminal press enter open up the terminal window leave it right there then go to your finder click on it go to applications make sure you have the installer file available install macOS Catalina but if you don't have it it's very easy just go to App Store it's free just click on search and search for Catalina click on it and get it it's for free that's how simple it is all right since I already have it and I'm already on this window what I'm gonna do is so the next thing you want to do is go back to your terminal type in sudo s u d o space then come back to this window right click on install macOS Catalina in my case since I'm using my MacBook Pro I have to tap with two fingers at the same time to do a right click I'm gonna do that click on show package contents then double click on contents double click on resources then scroll down until you see the create install media no space between them just drag and drop it into your terminal window that's it very simple now the next thing you want to do close that window we are done with that the next thing you want to do is insert your USB drive into your computer there it is my USB that's my USB drive come back to terminal type in dash dash volume space drag this USB drive and drop it into your terminal window but if you don't see it here another way to find it is go to finder then click on go then click on go to folder and you will see this thing already written just click on go it'll take you to your volumes you can drag it and you can drop it into that window then the next thing you want to do is just press enter it asks you to put your password I will type in my password there you go it's typed but it's not showing to you mine acts a little differently then once you type in your password press enter again or return key it says ready to start to continue we need to erase the volume so here's something important if you have some documents in your USB drive that you don't want them to get deleted it's better to get all those documents and transfer them to another USB drive otherwise everything will be erased and once you're done with that reinsert it and type Y for yes to erase the drive so mine is already erased there's nothing important in that drive so I'm gonna type in Y and press enter again there you go it's erasing the disk it'll take just a couple seconds there you go erasing is done and the name of my USB drive already changed into install macOS Catalina automatically right now it's copying all the data into that USB drive and the current version that I'm downloading that I'm installing on this USB drive is about 8 gigabytes so it's gonna take a long time like probably 20 minutes so what I'm gonna do right now is just leave this whole thing here and I'll come back to see if it's done in 30 minutes Alright guys, so it's done. Install media now available at 
and volumes in the Saul Michaelis Catalina. So let's see if it's ready. Just double click on it. In the Saul Michaelis Catalina. Double click. Yes, it's ready to install. I'm gonna quit it right now. But yeah, you got a bootable USB drive from Mac OS Catalina. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. Leave your comments. If you need to know how to install it as well, or if you have a computer that's passcode locked and you don't know how to bypass the password, just let me know and I'll help you out with that too. Alright guys, have a good one and don't forget to subscribe.